Rich, I mate, uh, just wanted to get this over to you um, for the feedback from the stuff we've done in the studio this week. Um, obviously, you're playing at the weekend and you wanted to um, you wanted to get in and have a bit of a look at, at why he wasn't striking it quite as good. Um, and obviously, off your handicap, plus one stroke, plus two, um, you've got really good knowledge of your golf swing, you've got really good knowledge of your own movement and, and what you do and what you feel. Um, and, and you kind of said at the start of the session that you feel like you're getting ahead of the shot and then um, through the impact having to, having to actually move back a little bit and you, you don't feel like you, you, you're very balanced. So you wanted to, to have a little bit of a look at what, you, what your pressure's doing. Um, obviously, this is your right foot. And this is your left foot. Um, when you start, you're, um, you're really evenly balanced between left and right. 55% pressure in your lead foot, 45% pressure in your trail foot. Um, that's going to make it, uh, that's a really good balanced position so you can push to the right side and in the backswing. But what you'll see with your, with your trace is a little bit messy. Um, you kind of, you kind of move, you press into the floor a little bit on the left side, which is fine. Um, a little bit of a forward press, and then you kind of move back into the into the trail side. Um, so you've got eighty-seven percent pressure in your in your trail side um, at this point, and um, at the top of the golf swing, you, you maintain that. You're at nine eighty-five. 80% pressure, you're starting, to, you're starting to to make a transition now. And then this this matches up, this trace matches up with exactly what, what you told me and what you felt. Um, pressure goes out into the toes in the transition. It's really good that the pressure's moving ahead of the club. The sequence is obviously floor upwards. So you're making your pressure move um, and the club is actually still going, going backwards there. Um, but the, the pressure does go out into the out into the toes quite a bit you'll see you'll see here um, you've got 95% pressure in your lead toe 88% pressure in your trail toe so you've got loads of pressure there um, in the in the toes and then you move into the lead foot really aggressively um, at this point 80% pressure in the in the lead foot and then this is exactly what you were telling me this is exactly what you felt you now feel like you have to back up so at this point you have 80% pressure in your lead foot but as you're coming down into impact your pressure is actually backing up 70% pressure 62% pressure yeah so just before impact with the ball, you've gone from 80% pressure at this point. Just before impact, you're at 57. That's exactly what you were telling me that you felt, which is which is really good, that you, you move a long way to the left and then you, you back that up a little, a little bit. Um, I've got some footage from the end of the session um still obviously the pressure goes out into the, the toes but this is a much more linear trace um you don't get the you don't get the backup uh, over here that you were experienced on uh on that on that first trace um we've obviously done a bit of work without your shoes on as well to help you feel it's a little bit better um your feelings this were not mine these, these are what this is what you were telling me from stuff you've done in the past a couple of years ago on, on balance pods um, your feelings was that you've got to stay behind the ball a little bit more from the from the top of the swing you've got to wait for it a little bit more you were doing some rehearsals where you were letting your arms come down um, even though that doesn't happen obviously when we hit the ball you, you have to use your pelvis but you were just feeling like your arms were just coming down a little bit more and this is a much more a much more linear trace so you'll see you you're loaded up on the back swing, 92% pressure. 
and then it still goes out into the toes a little bit in the in the transition so 100% in the right toe 100% in the left toe so you've not got your heels on the on the floor at that point they're not actually touching the floor but coming through the ball as you move towards impact um, the pressure doesn't move across quite as aggressively and you'll see a much more linear trace with no backup Rich, I hope this has helped um, give us a shout let us know how you get on at the weekend I'd love some feedback Cheers, Rich.